So I took a cold shower for 10 days and you won't believe your eyes what happened. Let's get into it. Cold showers, all right? Everyone was talking about this and is still currently talking about taking cold showers, cold therapy, and all kinds of different things. You have YouTubers like Wim Hof and all kinds of different people that are actually practicing this and preaching this to all people from around the world. But what is it and does it actually work? I went ahead and for 10 days straight did a cold shower every single morning. And today I'm going to be taking you through every single day that I've done and how it actually affected my body Body, my mindset and everything else involved. So when we think about these YouTubers that are actually preaching about cold showers and cold therapy, they say that there are massive benefits. There are also researches done continuously talking about the benefits of cold therapy and cold showers. Now, like I said, I went ahead and tested this out. So today I'm going to be sharing with you all the 10 days that I've done and that I've actually been doing this. And I have to say it was a challenge in the beginning. I didn't feel really well when I was doing these cold showers, but after a couple of days, something strange happened and that's something I'm going to be telling you in just a second. So let's get into how I did these cold showers and basically for how long I actually did them. So to start off with the first day, all right, like I said, I was completely mesmerized by the fact that I was needing to do something that I wasn't feeling comfortable with. But for the people that are following me for a long time and know what I'm actually all about in this channel, I am someone who wants to get out of his comfort zone and does that almost every single day. So when I started with these cold showers, Hours. Actually, the first thing that happened is my body got shocked, all right, completely shocked. And it almost froze because I was feeling so dreadful when being under that cold shower. And that's what actually happened the first day when I started doing it. It was uncomfortable. It wasn't something that I was really enjoying while doing. And it was something that I was looking to get out of as soon as possible, which is kind of the most thing when you try to get out of your comfort zone. So after that first day, you know, when I started keep doing it more and more and more, I started off basically the first day with around 30 seconds doing the cold shower. What I did notice immediately is that my breathing started like becoming like quicker and quicker and quicker. I was breathing like, like that. And what I noticed is that after I finished the cold shower, my entire body got red, right? So my entire body got red, my chest got red, my head got completely red. And I have no idea actually why that happened. Okay, perhaps there are some studies that actually also will talk about why that happens. But for me, that still happens to this day, you know? So after the first day, I actually felt like a lot better actually after doing the cold shower. So it was really weird. It was a strange feeling while doing it. I wasn't feeling the best, you know, within the 30 seconds that I was actually trying to do it. I was just thinking in my head, I wanna get out, I wanna get out, I wanna get out. And once I got out, I actually felt a lot better. I felt energized. I felt actually just woken up. Let's go! and felt like a woke person basically to mention it like that after doing the first day of the cold shower. So then my mind was like, all right, so this is not something that is a short-term gratification kind of thing. It's a long-term gratification because you gotta go through the pain and then start enjoying it. So that was kind of the first day. Then the second and third day, what happened and how long did I did these cold showers for then? So it was kind of the same as the first day, right? I was still feeling uncomfortable doing it. And it was something like, you know, the best example I can give is if you've never gone to the gym or haven't gone to the gym for a long time and you actually, you know, go to the gym for the first time after a long time or you've never been into the gym and it feels like you're basically someone who doesn't know basically what's going to happen if you are in that scenario. And that was kind of the same situation with myself. I was uncomfortable, not feeling well doing it and not knowing what was going to happen if I do it for even longer than 30 seconds, I thought probably I was going to pass out or something, right? So what happened in the second and third days is basically that I started doing a little bit longer increments in terms of the 30 second mark. And I started doing 30, 40, sometimes even like 50 or 60 seconds doing the cold shower. <laughs> What I noticed 
notice is instead of actually feeling worse, I actually noticed that after I finished the cold showers of 40 and 50 and 60 seconds, I actually felt even better. And I wanted to start doing it longer and longer and longer, right? So it was kind of the initial barrier that I needed to go through during that comfort zone of the first day and second day that I actually understood to myself, like if I do it even longer, I will feel even better. And that's actually when I realized that after the you know second and third day, I, this is really something that I enjoy doing. Let's go, bro. let's go. <sighs> <sighs> Yeah. And the fourth and fifth day, that's when everything completely changed for me because this is what happened. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go. Really slowing down my breath, really kind of controlling my breath and really knowing what I'm doing and how I'm feeling myself while I'm actually practicing the cold shower. Like I said, reaping just only benefits after I did it after the fourth and fifth day, which got me to think this is something I need to do not only you know, for this video or for like a challenge or a 10 day kind of thing, I need to do this for a longer period of time. So actually, by the time you're watching this video, I've actually been doing the cold shower for three weeks straight and I've been feeling like a superhuman or Superman, like Kent Clark basically, you know, stripping out his costume and going as Superman and flying all over the place. That's how I'm feeling right now. And that's how I felt the past couple of days. So definitely, definitely the fifth and sixth day were the days that actually everything changed. And after that, the seventh, eighth and ninth and 10th day, just to give you guys kind of a recap, I kind of increased the amount of time that I actually did the cold shower, which was, you know, from 30 and 40 and 50 seconds, I increased it to one minute and now doing it for two minutes, right? And what I actually do, and Kaho is here behind the camera, when I do the cold shower, I actually count basically the times, you know, the time that I'm actually under the cold shower. So I'm like one, two, three, four, five, and then I count all the way up to 120. Several days later. Easy, easy, let's go, let's go, let's go. And even when I'm at the 120 mark, I sometimes even stand like even longer for like 10 additional seconds, just because I said, I wanna feel like that superhuman, that superman, that Kent Clark feeling that you really wanna get and become the most woke person that you can be. So with that being said, that's kind of the recap for the 10 days challenge. And an overall recap and a score that I would like to give it to those 10 days is definitely an 11 out of a 10 of this specific challenge. The reason why I say that is because it's hard in the beginning, but with everything in life, whether it's you starting a business, whether it's you basically you know, going to the gym the first time or starting something to fix your personal or business life, it is difficult, right? But great things, are always difficult. Building a great team, building a great business, building a great company is also really difficult. But if you don't push through those initial barriers in the first couple of days, you are never going to be able to reach success, right? You can ask any person that has actually, you know, gotten success in life or in business, and they will tell you that you need to push through those initial barriers. So that's something that I also realized with the cold showers and something that I would really start preaching towards you guys and I'm definitely going to start preaching to my students because if you push through these things, business becomes easy, right? If you need to take a sales call or take multiple sales calls an entire day, it becomes easy because you've pushed through these initial barriers yourself. So that is kind of the benefits that I've gotten from it, right? And I would advise you guys to do it and kind of the score that I would give this challenge. And we're going to be doing multiple challenges in this specific channel. So if you are and wanting to be updated in terms of how we are actually going to do these challenges and when we are going to do those and what kind of challenge we are going to do, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and also like this video. Now, with that being said, an overall view and overall view in terms of the benefits, cold showers, it's difficult in the beginning, but if you push through, you're going to be reaping benefits from feeling more confident, trusting yourself more, getting out of your comfort zone and an overall superhuman, like I said, Superman, Clark Kent feeling that you really want to have. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you actually are going to try the cold shower. And if you're already trying it, try to increase kind of the time that you are doing because I'm going to perhaps start doing cold showers, I don't know, for the entire day perhaps. <laughs> Not just like 120 seconds or two minutes, perhaps like even for 10 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes and do like some even crazier shit on this channel. Excuse my language. So. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll be seeing you in the next one, perhaps another challenge. We'll see. Wish you an amazing day. Stay safe, stay humble. My name is Stefan, and I'll see you in the next one. Cool towers for the win! Let's go! <laughs> <laughs>